New at 11, you'll soon see bright blue buses around Macon. The Macon Bib Transit Authority rolling out two new electric buses. Ashlyn Webb was one of the first to catch a ride. She also talked to Macon Transit CEO Craig Ross about the new additions to the MTA fleet. Meet Spark and Bolt. These are the two new electric buses that will be hitting the road in Macon pretty soon. And what Craig Ross with the Macon Transit Authority says will be changing the face of transit here in Macon. It's, there's no fuel. It's all battery. It's all electric. So there's, there's no emissions to this at all. Ross says the Transit Authority is doing their part to reduce pollution. That will start making an impact on us, but there's still fossil fuel cars running around. We got one of the first rides on the bus. The first thing to notice is it's pretty quiet compared to a typical bus. And a lot of people ask me, was it running? I said, yes, yeah, already on. And since it's electric, there's absolutely no fuel. Ross says it's powered by battery pods, and a fully charged bus can run 215 miles before recharging. Smooth rise, smooth take off. We took a ride around town in the new bus, but soon they'll be on their normal routes. One will stay on the downtown corridor route, going to the medical center, down 2nd Street and on to Coliseum Hospital. Ross says the other will rotate routes. But these will be the only electric buses on the roads around here. Ross says Megan Transit Authority is the only transit system in the state with them, and it's all possible because of a $1.75 million grant from the Federal Transportation Administration. Megan Bib is is a small transit system. For us to compete on a national stage with only a $55 million grant available uh, for over 5,000 transit systems and for Macon to be able to win the, one of the top six uh, amounts of money of $1.75 million, we were elated to say the least. Ross says these will be hitting the road sometime around November 15th. Reporting in Macon, Ashlyn Webb, 13 W Maisie News. Hey, Craig Ross says this is only the beginning of their environmentally conscious fleet. They're working to get more electronic buses or electric buses in the future.